Hi all. Welcome to today's session. In this module, we are going to cover the basics of CPU. So let's first understand what a CPU is. A CPU means Central Processing Unit. You have already know it is the brain of the computer. It processes instructions. It runs the operating system and applications constantly receiving input from the user. In this picture, you can see a closed cabinet or closed case of CPU. Have you ever seen an open CPU? Here it is. I hope the parts are all very clear to you. Let's have a look on one by one. This is power supply or otherwise it is termed as SMPS, switch mode power supply. It supplies power for the system. Next is a fan. You can see a fan here. What is the fan? You, uh, what is the use of a fan? Fans are used to draw cooler air into the CPU case from outside. Next comes the video card. And then the main constituent of our CPU, that is motherboard. It is a main circuit board inside a computer that connects the different parts of the computer together. Now you can see a CD drive, hard drive, memory, etc. Now let's have a look on the block diagram of CPU. See the block diagram. Here you can see input unit. Input unit, the two device, the name of two input devices are given here. That is the keyboard and mouse. The data from the input device is transferred into this CPU, central processing unit. And the CPU is here divided into three parts. You can see this in the picture. Which are those three units? Arithmetic and logic unit, control unit and the memory unit. What's happening here in arithmetic and logic unit? All the arithmetic operations that is the addition, subtraction, comparison etc. are being done here. Next comes the control unit that is the most important part of the CPU. This unit controls and coordinates the activities of all other units. And next is MU or memory unit. It is the storage place of a computer. All the activities that you are doing on a computer can be stored in this memory unit. And after the processing, the result is passed to the output unit. And the output devices, examples of some are monitor, printer, speaker, etc. All those are the examples of output unit. Hope you have understood the topic on CPU. Thank you.